More summer championships wrapped up this week as we approach the fall season at full throttle. In the past seven days, we handed out titles on the golf course, the baseball diamond, and in the rodeo arena, plus a few other surprises in this week's MTN Game Changers. At number five, let's go to the Butte Country Club for the Montana State Women's Amateur. MSU golfer Lauren Greeny cruised to an 11-stroke victory for back-to-back -back championships, firing a two under 69 in the third and final round. At number four, entering the final day of the State AA Legion Baseball Tournament, the Missoula Mavericks needed to beat the Helena Senators twice to claim the title. Well, mission accomplished. The Mavs picked up a 4-0 and 6-1 win to topple the defending champs in advance to the Northwest Regional Tournament in Billings. At number three, we got four nights of the Big Sky Pro Rodeo Roundup in Great Falls, featuring all kinds of superstars, including Dalton Massey, currently the number one steer wrestler in the world, goes 3.9 seconds in round number two to win the rodeo with eight seconds on two head. At number two, no one braver than the four to six year olds who signed up for mutton busting, and no one more determined than five year old Annie, who took home the title with an 89 point ride on Saturday and earned a fancy belt buckle to show all her friends. And at number one, the Montana Coaches Association held its annual clinic in Great Falls and inducted two new members into the MCA Hall of Fame. Congratulations to Butte Central's Meg Murphy and Thompson Falls Randy Simon, recognized by their peers for success and dedicated service over the years. As always, if you see something you think we should see, send an email to sports at krtv.com and tell us how to find it, and we'll do our best to include it in next week's edition of Game Changers. Tom Wiley, MTN Sports.